whole video, kind of. Uh, today I'll be going over some new music equipment stuff that I got for my birthday that's in two weeks. So I got a new electric guitar, well not a new one, my first one, which is really awesome and exciting, and an amp, and some other bits and bobs that we'll go into shortly. So, shall we begin? Let's begin. Ta-da! I got an Ashton guitar case, uh, which is really cool. It's got, it's like a padded one, I think. And it's got like an orange trim, which I kind of like. And it's got many, many pockets to hold all your glorious things. So we've got a lead. Come on, amplifier, it's time for your walk. So this plugs into the guitar and the amp and makes sounds come out, which is cool and a good thing. And here we also have a thing that makes it sound like there's a UFO landing. You guys know what this is, don't you? You screw it into like the front and then things happen. It's cool. And then in here, dun 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 So this is an LTD ST213 guitar. And this is like the classic sort of sunburst design. Oh, this strap I got for like a few bucks from JB Hi-Fi. It's just like an ordinary guitar strap. It was originally for the acoustic, but I can take it on and off as I please. So we'll put it on here for now. So this has a maple neck which is pretty cool, uh, and there's a screw on, bolt on, whatever it is, as you can see under here. It's got LTD tuners, uh, I can't remember what the fingerboard is, I think it's rosewood? I don't know, I'll leave a link to the website with all the actual details below because I'm not, as you can tell, I don't really know what I'm out talking about. It's got a, a volume knob and two tone uh, swivelly things. know what the tone does so if any guitarist can leave comments below explaining that to me that'd be awesome it's also got like five different uh, sounds it can have by flipping this switch thing so yeah this this UFO machine thing uh, just screws in screws in here it's got 22 frets a uh, three burst finish and a white uh, scratch board uh, so let's move on to the amp before we start plugging it in and making some epic sounds in the thing that says guitar because that makes sense and then also in here like that you can just switch it on so uh, we turn the master volume up like that so we've got four different settings we've got clean which is basically your standard sort of no noise kind of thing then you've got crunch which is a bit more Sounds a bit more like an electric. With a bit of like. Then you've got metal. Which is real like rock guitar territory there. Uh, that's cool. And then there's a button labelled INSANE. Like, I'm not strumming very hard guys, I'm just like... Let's turn the volume down a bit. So that's all the different like modes, let's go back to clean. I'll show you what the UFO thing does. It's not called a UFO thing, I don't know what it's actually called. <laughs> So it makes funny noises, which is quite cool, I do like that. Then we've got drive bass, mid, treble, and channel volume. So, if anyone knows what any of those do, please comment below. So yeah, I'll, I'll do a bit of research. This is a Line 6 amp, uh, it's, the, it's the Spider 515. And we've also got a, a, a few different things. We've got chorus, flange, phaser, uh, tremolo, sweep echo, Tape echo and uh, reverb. Um, we've got the master volume and we've got the on and off switch. And we've also got output, um, which means that we can plug headphones in if you don't want to disturb anyone. Uh, you, do you need like a converter thing? <laughs> That's just a constant. 
an echo. <laughs> settings for that. I'm not going to go through all of them. Okay guys, so thanks for watching. Um, in like six months when I actually know what I'm talking about, I might make another video kind of going into depth about all the technical stuff. But for now, uh, basically to sum up, awesome guitar, if you want to actually know what it's all about, links will be in the description. Uh, also awesome amp, different buttons, an insane button, which is insane. So yeah, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!